I'm Dan Kluger and we're sitting here at ABC Kitchen. Pretzels were always a, a snack, um, whether it was school or something else. And so growing up here, I've always kind of seen the, the pretzel guy on the street corner. And so the, the hot, soft, warm pretzel has always been a, a big thing of New York City. When we, when we started working on ABC Kitchen, walking through the farmer's market looking for different ingredients, I was with Greg Brainin, the, the corporate chef for Jean George, and we saw Martin's pretzels, local pretzels, amazing. And it kind, of, it kind of clicked. We knew we wanted to use them for something savory. It seemed to make sense to grind them up into a powder and use them as part of a flour. And from there, it was just kind of, what was it going to be a, a flour for? Was it a dessert? Was it a coating? Et cetera. And it ended up becoming a coating. And, and uh, here we are today with our pretzel cut, crusted calamari. First, we whip egg whites and we coat the calamari with the egg whites for them to sit for a little while. And that's going to help everything adhere to it. And then we take the um, pretzels. We actually use non-salted pretzels. We grind them into flour with all-purpose flour, and then basically just toss the calamari in with the pretzel flour, fry it in a normal fashion. We serve it with a spicy marinara, um, basically our tomato sauce with a ton of dried market chilies. And then I kind of, again, thinking back to the street carts and the hot pretzels, I thought about mustard and pretzels and wanted to do some kind of mustard dip, and, and we end up with a mustard aioli. I remember my father bringing home the the big bags of pretzels, and that was kind of our, you know, sitting around the house snack. Um, so when I saw these, it was it was kind of reminiscent of the old days. Something that uh, will be on the menu probably for forever at ABC. It's it's kind of becoming an ABC classic. So this is our pretzel dusted calamari at ABC Kitchen. Come on by soon and have some. It's good New York local food.